Welcome to the One Minute Apologist. One Minute Apologist. We interview the world's leading apologists to provide credible answers to curious questions. Frank, don't we get all of our truth only from science? No, because that very statement itself is not from science, is it? You can't go in the laboratory and prove that statement. That's a philosophical claim. And in fact, most of the things we know are not from science. In fact, the laws of logic that we use to learn everything else are not scientific. They're metaphysical. And you can't do science without philosophy. Science is built on philosophy. Science is built on these metaphysical principles of the laws of logic, cause and effect, uniformity. Uh, all of these are metaphysical principles that you have to use in order to do science. So the idea that we get all our truths from science, as wonderful as science is, mm -hmm. is simply misplaced because science itself depends on metaphysical principles and knowledge. Look, you, you can't get ethical truths from science. Mm -hmm. You can't uh, talk about uh, the most important things in life, relationships. We, you know, we, we know yeah. our husbands and our wives and our, our relatives not through science. We know them because we interact with them. Uh, God, we know not through science. Scientific uh, claims may help us show that there is a being beyond the world who created and sustains the world, but we don't know him directly through science. We know him through the effects, his effects. So, no, we don't get all our truths from science. We get some of our truths from science. Yeah, this is important. We need to keep our eyes open as Christians because people that are naturalists may try to use that, and we need to really discern through that. Well said. In fact, we have another one-minute apologist we did some time ago called Science Doesn't Say Anything Scientists Do. People ought to check that one out.